Lights up, Bronx starts middle. This is your principal, Mr. Gonzalez, bringing you your news for today, Wednesday, April 17, 2019. Today's a B day. The method is artist process, followed by growth mindset, visual thinking strategies, artist palette, and of course, base. The Bronx Arts Soaring Scholars. Reminding you, be your best, attend school each day. Show respect for self and others, and succeed academically. And that is base. But for today, let's put a spotlight on the New York State testing program and the mathematics test, which starts May 1st. Then you will test on May 1st and May 2nd, and that is nine days away. Nine days away, scholars. So let's talk about some data in action. All right, let's talk about an item analysis. I want you each to look at this. This is from the week of March 19th. And let's look at the answer. You have the four questions. You can see that three is one that the green right there, the 63%, well, that many of you got right. Do you notice the two? One was not a good day. A lot of misconception there. But if you notice beyond A, B, C, and D, you see B, C, D, B, C, D, empty, a, B, C, D, B, C, D on number four, and then an A, B. How many answers are there to each question? One, uno. Marking more than one, if you think you've got it down to the last two that you are almost sure it's between them and maybe they'll give me credit. One, our tip to you today, is when you're doing a multiple choice test and you do not know the answer, you've tried everything, you've gotten it down to two or three, or maybe you just don't know, the best thing you can do is make an educated guess at one, only one. And if you leave it empty, then you've just ruined your chances even further. Make a guess, never ever leave it blank. All right, thank you. Moving right along in transitions, you are okay to walk the halls. Are you okay to walk the halls when it's not a transition without a pass? No. Have a pass if it is not a transition. And passes are located in your planner. Don't have a planner? Buy one. They are for sale in the main office for $5. We provide you one at the beginning of the year, then you buy one if you need an additional one or if you lost one. Not an additional one, if you lost one. Now, base points will be deducted during our transitions. So make sure that you are following our hallway expectations. And let's talk about hallway expectations. Scholars, we are trying to treat you like middle school students, allowing you to transition on your own, walking to your own classes, but please act like middle school students. Running in the hallways, that's about as elementary as it gets, folks, okay? So let's walk in our hallways. Screaming and running in the hallways, real elementary. So let's not do that during our transitions. Got it? All right. We have a new dismissal procedure we have been doing. Make sure that you follow this procedure each and every day. Line up with your advisor after your lockers. And your advisor will be the one who's going to dismiss you to your various areas. If you are picked up, if you walk self-dismiss, you'll be walking with your advisor outside. At BAM, we believe in respect. That's right. And what does it mean here at BAM? You know that communicating with respect is this. Lately, we've talked about how to show respect. And that is that you always lead with kindness and respond with kindness. That is respect, and that is all we are asking for here at BAM. Now, the call board for our school announcements. Scholars, a blitz. A blitz is unannounced. We'll focus on one of these four characteristics of base what will it be? What will it be? Who knows? Is it today? Is it tomorrow? Is it Friday? I don't know. What could it be? Is it food? Is it, is, it, is it waterboard torture? I don't know. But you need to make sure that you are following these four principles of base each and every day. After school today, we do not have after school because it is a Wednesday. And we are reminding you to you always bring your ID because now you have to scan in each and every morning. And if you're late, you still scan in at the cast machine. And if, before you go, make sure that those chairs are up. Scholars, I believe that the Battle of the Advisories has been extended. Who will it be? We have a first place winner. Who will take second? And remember, our goal is 80%.
So let's meet our goal. Let's do it. Bring in those surveys. Turn in those parent surveys. And we have nothing more to say than shine bright like...